Today on Brendan's Fabulous World of Fishing, we talk about a simple tip that's going to improve the way you drop shot fish. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Now, a lot of you guys may know I love to fish the drop shot. I made a whole instructional video on how to do it. I'll link that up there for those of you who have not fished the drop shot before. But for those of you who have fished the drop shot before, you know that a lot of times the lures we use on a drop shot, we use small worms and we use these small like grub-like baits. They're actually made for drop shotting. But I saw something recently that kind of changed the way I think about drop shot fishing. Let me explain. Now the drop shot is a very versatile rig. It is designed to keep your bait off the bottom and suspended in the water column. Now traditionally we use small worms and other small grub-like plastics on the drop shot, but I think it's time to change that. What if we put a swim bait on the drop shot? It would imitate a minnow kind of suspended in the water column, maybe like it's dying or wounded. What if we put a tube on the drop shot? That would be another great idea. You could also put a craw on the drop shot and that would look really cool as well. You could even put a hard bait on the drop shot, let's say like a jerk bait, and you could fish it really slow and subtle to get those bites when the bass are finicky. So this is something that's kind of changed the way I think about a drop shot. You can go crazy with it. You can put all different types of lures on it, um, and it's just a great, great idea. Now I was inspired to make this video by a video by Wired to Fish. They took a swim bait and put it on a drop shot, and that kind of opened my mind up. I was like, well, if you can put a swim bait on a drop shot, you could put a ton of other things on a drop shot. I'll link their video right there. So there's a quick tip for you. Try different baits on a drop shot besides small little worms and grubs, and I think you'll do pretty well. Thanks for watching this episode of Brendan's Fabulous World of Fishing, and stay tuned for the next episode. I will see you guys later.